honestly, when we started this job, I heard the name TSMC and I was trying to look them up online. I had no clue who TSMC was. TSMC, the company that today is clearly the world leader in building semiconductor chips. We make the most complicated devices in the history of mankind. Those chips go into practically any device that you use. <laughs> Guess what? TSMC makes most of those. TSMC chips end up in virtually every electronic device one can imagine. Televisions, refrigerators, and personal computers. They run our coffee makers in the morning, <laughs> and that's the most important. Almost every other industry in the electronic space depends on semiconductors for what they do. We even have products that have gone to outer space and are right now filming Mars. Touch on confirmed. We're safe on Mars. What we're producing in TSMC is the world's most advanced semiconductor technology, period, bar none. TSMC has really worked to expand our capacity footprint for the last 35 years. We have fabs around the globe. In North Phoenix, Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company's chip plant will produce microchips for some of the world's biggest suppliers of computers, smartphones, automobiles, and appliances. What we're building in Phoenix is a city. Our property goes nearly two miles in this direction and a little over one mile in this direction for a total of 1,140 acres. A footprint that was large enough to enable future expansion. It very much gives the impression of like a science fiction movie in the sense that it's like something really big is being built. And it's gonna be producing something really important and lots of really important things will come from that. Seeing the progress of construction at the site, it's not simply massive and large, but also the technologies that go into a semiconductor fab are beyond state of the art. The production operation takes place primarily on the third level, and that is the so-called clean room. I remember walking to the clean room the first time and just look up the ceiling, and I never seen something this magnitude and you just see a line of tools where probably you cannot even see anymore. And I remember first couple of times I got, I got lost into the clean room, right? I had to call some of my engineer and said, um, I'm here, how do I get out? It's just remarkable to think of what we do at the atomic level. For reference, if you were to grab a piece of your hair right now, the thickness is about 50 micrometers. We've been pushing that size down. 10,000 times smaller than that thickness of your hair. To put 100 billion transistors on a single chip is incredibly difficult. We are tricking light using extreme ultraviolet technologies to be able to print line widths at that geometry. This business is a trust-based business. And at TSMC, therefore, our purpose is to unleash the innovation of our customers. The future of the chip industry is our future, and TSMC is the bedrock. Now, we could not do what we do without our partnership with TSMC. We're the canvas that they write their designs on. As many of you know, we work with TSMC to manufacture the chips that help power our products all over the world. We will manufacture over 600,000 wafers a year, right here in the great state of Arizona. As I look around this facility, I'm reminded of a great engineer who once wrote, the future cannot be predicted, but futures can be invented. TSMC and its manufacturing is going to become foundational to the new economy whether it's the renewable energy economy, whether or not it's the new way that we're going to be doing health care, they're all going to be enhanced and driven by microelectronics. This is the new era of emerging technology for the country, and it's happening right here in Phoenix, Arizona. Yeah.